Hey guys, your friendly neighborhood Canadian here, hi in the TGA, and today we're going to be doing the Bartholomew Hornswoggle level 1. Uh, so we just have to retrieve the three pieces of the map here. Uh, so for planning, we're going to bring along our gun, take a briefcase, throw in the Commer 1, and uh, starting off at the resort pier. So uh, let's hit play. All right, so we're just going to grab our tranquilizer gun out of the briefcase. Make our way over to the security guard. Well, we're going to make our way to the um, laundry room first, grab the keys, and then go to the security guard hut. So I'm just going to run down these stairs here. You don't need the briefcase anymore. You can drop it anywhere you like. Um, but I'm just keeping it with me. Just who knows? You never know. So we'll just come in here come in this door whoops grab the keys right there come out the door here and then we're just gonna go into this door over here unlock it with the keys that we just got and then we'll just come here grab the uh, map off the wall and then we're gonna run across back over this way up the deck or across the deck and we're just gonna drop down over here So what we're going to do now is we're going to find the captain and we're going to take him out with our seeker, com uh, yeah, the calmer. So he's coming in here. So he's going to be basically, we can just shoot him right through the window here. So we'll just crouch, turn it on, shoot him real quick, put away your gun and uh, we'll just come over here, pick up his piece of the map. And now we're going to run over to uh, to the mansion area. So we'll just come down the stairs here on the beach. And you can basically just come over here and follow the pathway. So we'll just run past these two guards and we're going to go over to the uh, scaffolding nah, and just right jump up and then jump please. over uh, the wall, opening in the wall here. And we're going to crouch and start running through the bushes. And then once we see this opening here, we're just going to come over here. Right there, we'll throw on our... Uh, Kruger Meyer, and we're going to be taking out the, the bottle right there, and that'll give us our third piece of the, uh, or the third piece of the treasure map. So then we're just going to come over here, we're going to hug the wall, and then we're just going to spam the square button, and uh, steal his disguise. And now all we're going to do is we're just going to run over to the other beach. The little island over here. And we'll go underneath that uh, deck there. And we'll pick up the shovel and the booty. And then that's pretty much it. All we need is the sword from the booty. You don't need the costume or anything like that. But uh, here's the uh, shovel. And then the dig area is right here. So once the booty is all dug up, you can just open it up. And I mean, you can take whatever you want. It doesn't really matter. There is the disguise in there. And there is also uh, another coin to bloom. But I'm just going to uh, drop the shovel. And I'm just going to run over to the plane, the airplane. Now the keys, I believe, are under there too. I guess we could have ran to the scooter, the water scooter. I didn't really think of that at the time, but... Uh, oh, I think they're under there. I could be wrong. I know they are on the regular missions. I don't know about the escalation. 
So anyways, we get in the plane and we are off. That's Silent Assassin for uh, level one. All right. All right, so we're just going to run over here. We're going to equip our sword and we're going to take out the first of our eight targets. We'll just stab him through the back. Now you can pick up the gun, but the thing is, once you pick up his body, it's not like the samurai sword for some reason. It won't let you pick up two two weapons. So you got to pick up his body and then drop the samurai sword. Or, I mean, the uh, weapon over there. We're going to take out uh, the jogger's bodyguard. It's funny. I've, I've finished this level, and I can't remember what the jogger's name is for the life of me. I know he's one of the main targets, but... Uh, <laughs> so we're just going to wait for him to pass. Just tossing the sword at him. And again, I'm going to try and pick up the gun, pick up my sword, and, uh, oh, it let me pick up that gun. Maybe just, just shotguns, it won't let me do. So we're going to drag him in the bush. Oh, no, see, my sword is out here now. So I'm going to grab my sword, and we're going to run underneath the deck here, and we're going to pick up a coin and the keys. To the uh, water scooter. Now I am going to keep my co coins equipped and we're going to wait for that far guard there to turn around. Once he turns around I'm going to toss a coin just over their heads and equip my sword right after. So I'll just toss the coin, equip my sword and then I'm going to stab this guy, stab this guy, pick up the gun, and drag his body into the, into the grass here, the shrubs, and then I'm going to grab this guy, and grab him as well. Now see the, there's two guns out there, so... Hopefully he doesn't see that gun. Anyways, yeah, it's a, it's amazing that they made that kind of a glitch on this, but uh, it is what it is. So I'm just going to pick up this propane tank. Now that jogger, he should actually have another uh, bodyguard with him now. But, uh, so we got four already. I am going to take out this girl here. Oop. Okay, back to business. So we're just going to quickly uh, drag her into the bushes as well. Yeah, so he's on the scooter, right, the water scooter right now. His bodyguard is right there with him. So right now we got these two guys. Wow. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Once he sits down, I'm going to take out this guy with the... Uh, tank. I'm going to equip my sword right away. Stab him. I'm going to throw my other sword or my sword at his head. And I'm going to drag them both into the bushes. Okay. 
Now, it does sound panicky, but uh, it isn't right now. So now we just got two targets left and they are in high alert mode, which is odd, but uh, as long as you know where everybody is, you can okay, take this guy out first and then drag his body into the, off to the side here underneath the deck. Make sure you grab your uh, sword, and then we can take him out. Oh, shoot. And that should be our number eight so now all we have to do is locate the exit it's not the fastest but <laughs> you know it is what it is so we'll just run our little booty ass over to the uh sea do and uh hit us hit escape <laughs> There is our silent assassin for level two. Okay, so for the Bartholomew Hornswoggle level three, um, <clears throat> it's kind of the same, but it's we just have two added targets here that we have to take out with the cannon. Um, so, uh, and it's restricted loadout. So we'll just hit play here. Okay, so first off, we're going to take out this security, or this uh, guard here. with we'll throw the sword at his head. Well, you can pick up the cannonball and his gun. And then drag his body into the bushes here. Drop his gun. Grab his sword. And we're going to come over here with our cannonball equipped. Take him out. And then just drag him to the edge and throw him over. For now. <clears throat> so now we can come over and we can take out this guy. Throw the sword at his head here. Pick up the cannonball. And his gun. Drag his body into the bush. And we're gonna just drop the whoops, drop the gun. And pick up our sword. I'm just going to run under the deck here and we're going to take care of that, that lady in the background after uh, yeah they're both up there right now Just uh, take her out. Please, please, and then you 
got to get him quick too because otherwise uh, he'll alert the island. So we're just going to toss him. him in the freezer here. Pick up your sword. Throw it at the target's head. Drag him into the freezer as well. Pick up your sword again. Pick up the uh, cannonballs. You don't need the keys. Uh, we're going to blow up the thing later here. So, uh, so right now we're going <clears> to... <throat> Come over here to these two guys. And I'm just going to knock them both out real quick. Just so I don't have to... Uh, have to worry about it. Yeah, you know, like... I don't know. I just want to make sure that I got them knocked out first. So I can... Uh, I don't have the... <coughs> Sorry, I'm kind of stuttering right now. I'm not sure. I just want to make sure that... <coughs> that they don't spot anything and then uh, basically just alert the island. So I'm just going to drop their guns. In the bushes as well and grab the... Uh, Cannonballs. So now uh, we should just have a, two more gar uh, guards to take care of. So I'm just going to creep over here. Toss the ball at this guy and that guy. I just I'm just doing knockouts first because it, it's uh it's kind of like you got so many cannonballs already, right? So it's more like uh. It's more like rapid fire when you <laughs> when you're doing it here. So we've gotten our eight targets down now. Uh, I'm just gonna grab the gun and stuff and just hide it in the bushes here. Make sure you get your cannonballs. So now all we have left are the uh, the water scooter guys, jet ski guys. I think I don't. Yeah, that's it. So we can just pick up uh, some gunpowder, and we're gonna load up the cannons. here and I'm going to load up this other cannon. <clears throat> I know the gunpowder should go in first, but <laughs> I don't think it really matters here. So what we're going to do is wait for this guy here to uh, jump on his scooter. He's going to go out the farthest and then he's going to start to cut in. And then that's when we're going to uh, shoot the cannon here. Oh shoot, I forgot to... Uh, oh, come on. I forgot to use the cannon first, I thought... 
Well, that worked out anyways. Got him on his way back. So now we just have the uh, the last one here. Oh shoot, he's already on his cannon. Or already on his scooter. I can't believe that he didn't even like panic. <laughs> so if you miss it like I just did, we'll uh, reload it up again. And we'll just have to wait until he comes back out. Which actually might be a little bit longer than I thought. But yeah. Sorry about that. Hopefully you have better luck on your first shot. all of our achievements done and now all we have to do is just make our way to the plane and uh, get out of here and we do have our silent assassin rating still so that's good So please remember to like, subscribe, share, hit that notification bell if you'd like any of my future videos, and uh, comment below. Thanks for watching guys, I appreciate it. There's our silent assassin, and our new buccaneer uh, suit. <laughs> Right on. Okay.